Yo, what's going on, guys? Matthew V. Haynes here, aka the Clock Master. We are back. I'm here with Mommy Master. We are back to do yeah. Superman and Lois. Um, Mommy Master, it's been a while since you've been on the channel. Yeah, good to be in the chair. The chair feeling strange. <laughs> speak, to, speak to the people. I know the people. Yeah, to you. yeah, man. I'm trying to adjust my butt in the chair. Everything feeling strange. Please, strange. Place cool. I'm sure y'all never see me in long sleeve, so you could understand. But it's good to be back. It's good to be back. I'm waiting to see what's gonna happen. The man daughter arrive. Yep, that was the last thing. I was rewatching. I was rewatching that episode uh, before this one. So, well, I didn't look back at it. All I remember is that she turned up and she be and she was like, "Dad," and she pointing at Lois. Mm. So I'm waiting to see what gonna happen after that. I mm -hmm. was waiting for this for a while. Yeah, it's been. I mean, they've been pretty good at um at getting us the stuff, you know, like when we needed it on time. So like we didn't have to wait too too long. Okay. So because the last time we had season two, I mean season one was like when I moved. Mm -hmm. Last episode. Last episode, I think was like a day or two before I moved okay yeah so guys like if you, you're probably wondering where our finale reaction is to season one i didn't get a chance to upload that unfortunately um the video i have it somewhere on the computer so um, yeah because he was busy getting married yeah i was busy getting married i was moving uh it was a really busy time and then just this thing just kind of got ahead of me and other shows kind of took more priority and then life just got got busy and and here we are so at least i can we can do season two for you guys so. Yeah, Mr. Cup Master is Mr. Husband. <laughs> hey, I know some some people haven't been on the channel um since since the Superman since the last Superman and Lois, so they don't even know that. So um for those who don't who, who only come for certain shows. And I, I know y'all gonna ask about the flash. Um I'm gonna just keep it quick. Like mom mom and I just weren't really feeling like reacting to the flash this season. We just weren't really feeling it too much. Um we don't really at least i don't intend on watching it anytime soon i don't know about you i even forget that it's on that's to show you that i've lost interest in it the storyline is just messed yeah. up i don't understand why people got to merge and verses coming together and a whole crap again we've seen enough of that so yeah i mean I, I've, I've, I been wanted... hearing, I've been hearing people saying that this season was good but you know i don't know i don't know I heard it was good. Some people said it was good. Some people said it was bad. Some people said the the, the crossover was was good. I just I just I, from the clips that I've seen, it just wasn't enough to interest me to get back into it. So, quite frankly, I wasn't, I wasn't feeling excited. I always look forward to Flash. I miss it. Every minute I would be asking Matthew, "When is this thing coming back? When it come?" I was not excited. Like, oh, I'm excited to see Star Girl and Superman and Lois. Yeah, and, and so... like. I mean, and I and um and I saw Naomi actually. I saw the first episode of Naomi a, a couple weeks back for an uh, interview that I had with the cast, which was really amazing. I, I should be posting that video pretty soon. Um, I think they just released they released the video to us to post, so pretty soon. So I'll be sharing that. But it was it was interesting. But I mean, Naomi looks like it could be interesting. But I mean, like with Superman and Lois, though, like this is like really honestly, truly the only show that is and and Star Girl that that has me excited to like to watch um, anything so on the cw because other than that it's pretty much just everything else that i've been doing so uh, but yeah I, I think we should just get right into it it's been a really good show so far subscribe if you want to see the rest of our reactions to superman and lois because this show is a one season one was great so hopefully season two continues to be amazing and to you know continues to, to give us great stories and and great action and, and you know keep it nice and short like a nice 10 episodes and like you know that's good that's good enough for me so, mm -hmm. all right, you ready to get in this thing? Yep. All right, guys, make sure to subscribe, leave your comments and thoughts down below. We'll talk about it later as you normally do. Let's get into it now. Yeah. Ooh. She's still so Ooh. Mm. Ooh. He can't say nothing. 
You wanna call her? Wish her luck or something? Clark, I don't know what to tell you. She still won't talk to me, okay? Yeah, but why would she need to talk to Natalie? Yeah, I, I don't know. Why is he forcing her to talk to her after? Uh, he probably just wants to see you. You get in touch with first. Hmm. Hey. Hey. Hi, I, I know I, uh, I, I probably should have texted first. Couldn't wait another second. Nah, she met somebody else. Well, your timing kind of sucks. Yeah, she met somebody else. Yep. <laughs> They gotta give Jonathan some stuff to do. Yeah, you're right. That's, the girl, that's one of the girls you to start talking to the last time. Woo. I missed that. Damn. <laughs> wow. I wish I could do the. Oh, I missed this. Ooh. Wow. Oh, what the heck? Whoa, 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 whoa. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, he can't go below below certain things or? They speak in Korean. Are they North Korean? Jeez, what's going on with him? His head. Oh, maybe the side effects from the, um, from the, um, eradicator. Oh gosh. It's probably side effects from the eradicator. Jeez. Wow. Wow. <laughs> wow. Oh, dude, the, yo, the music here. The music oh, here. Yeah. Oh, wow. Look at this scenery. <laughs> dude. <laughs> <laughs> no, he gonna go work on himself to everybody dealing with something. Your name is Natalie Johnson. Bro. And I'm Henry Johnson. And we just moved here from a planet that was totally destroyed by psychopathic Kryptonians. Jonathan, relax yourself, kiddo. Jonathan? What? I'm so sorry. Right now. I can explain. I'm aware of you. Ah, <laughs> uh, the new dude. Yes, he's just arrived. He looks like he's not gonna want to work as Superman. You rescued a North Korean submarine. I knew it. One, and then you returned it to them. Could you just dropped it by American soil? Your firm commitment. That hey, you gonna threaten them? Come first. Our working relationship is gonna have to change. Important now. He's Superman. He's not. He's not America's Superman. He's the world's uh, Superman. Everything okay? Go up to your room. Happily. It's not the worst thing in the world. You don't gotta call him away from that. Is it I came home to find our... Come on, Tim. What are you thinking? He's, He's a boy. He's old and home with <laughs> his new girlfriend. Duh. Pretty obvious what he was thinking. Duh. No. And parents nine months from now. Wow. Oh Clark, my God, Louis. Do you? No. No, I guess I don't. Okay, so now you're just criticizing. That is for real emergencies, Lois. Not yeah. to get me home to talk about some high school hookup. That's true, though. Fine. Fine. Lois, you gotta get figure out what's going on with you, because he's right there. You can't you can't use the ELT for that. Like the most. Yeah, he's getting things. so much control over his powers. I mean, Love it. Oh. oh. Wow. Wow. How'd you light all those? She actually kissing him back though. Well, I don't know what's going on with she. Is everything all right? Yeah, it's. She she's it's seeing someone else. I here and I'm I'm feeling sort of cranky. I I didn't know. Of course you didn't. I mean, it's not really something I text you about. She going back to this texting texting thing. Yeah. Well, uh, what Daniel means is that he is pro schools. And if that means giving the teachers the raises they deserve, then this administration will see that it gets done. Politics. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Dude, you're a bad pop. I would have never, I would have not and fall for that. <laughs> I've already got the best people working for me. She drunk, she know what's going on. <laughs> no, Dad, it's super simple. I 
never should have come here. Talked about this. Okay? Damn. It's just, it's gonna take some time. No, I've been here three months. Three it's months. More than enough time to realize that I don't belong. That's so tough. All these men dealing with different women right now. You're late. Yeah. Good. Mm. That's it. Define good. What do you want me to say? Actual answer. I, I, he I said it was good. Weird about it. Are you sure she was telling the truth? Mm, she wasn't. Wait, why, why would she be lying about that? You can die later. About what? <laughs> if Daniel can get Amy's support, he might be able to oh, take one vote away from Dean. I mean, it doesn't matter how many times I ask him, he just... Avoids the question? Forgot she knows he's Superman. It makes me feel like he's hiding something from me. Are we still talking about Kyle? <laughs> I guess we're just gonna have to finish this whole bottle of wine. It's called it out. marriage. What? What? Did you feel that? Was that the missile? Was that an earthquake? Any luck? Nope. That's probably the missile from the from the soldiers. Isn't maybe just from er, maybe everything that just happened from the from the last season that that wasn't terrible advice <laughs> hey buddy boy you gotta go check that yeah you gotta go check that you gotta check that now oh boy it's probably the missile yeah but he left the missile he left the thing where it was he no, didn't bring they it they, no they probably found a way to get back in the ocean Jeez. Jeez, nice. Oh, oh shoot. Lord. Oh gosh. Oh shoot. Oh. <laughs> oh gosh. Some people Oh shoot. Who is that? Wait, what? What? Who is them? Wait, what? Who the heck are they? You gotta get the head fixed. They got super people working for the DOD. They created their own super people. The army. They created their own super people. They probably got Superman's DNA. But the tremors seem to have stopped. Yeah, you see, they got Superman yeah. symbols. He gotta walk this Who guy, Daniel. They're from our school. Your school? Surely General Lane told you that the DOD is training. Saving people during an earthquake, that's one thing. They're not ready for what's out there in the world. Repeatedly. You're that's not supposed to work for you. What you asked for was my allegiance to America. And you refused. Because I gave it to the world a long time ago. No. To them, it does. I'd love to have you. Dude, really? America can have more than one Superman. Dude, that is his family crest. That's that's it. That is his family wow. symbol. That's hard for her, man. Both of them. I'm sorry for what happened to you, Natalie. I've been thinking a lot about that moment since you left. To make yourself feel better. Mm -mm. Okay, children coming in the kitchen, man. You guys do with a door. <laughs> <laughs> That's not what I came up here to talk about, though. Hey, 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 here we go. No, 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 no. This one's on you, buddy. See, yeah, 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 it kind of is. We cannot have a repeat of what happened here today. Intimate with someone. But that's <laughs> an adult decision. And it comes with some pretty adult feelings that... So. It's true. If and when you guys have any questions... Thank you. Let's, both of you. let's normalize these conversations with our kids, please. <laughs> I just want you guys to be responsible. Always. Real Everyone? talk. Yes, of course. Okay. Real talk. Good talk. No, you're gonna hear <laughs> more than a few words from her. That is simple. <laughs> Who? Who this? Oh, okay. Adam right, come on. Husband, Clark, and these are my boys, Jonathan and Jordan. It's like their brother. They it's crazy because they both all three of them shared the same DNA. It's crazy, right? Literally, they all three of them share the same DNA. Now, what are you gonna do with this thing with this army stupid man with the yeah, they gonna gotta, on your suit? 
Yeah, they don't gotta get rid of him. Are they watching him? What's going on? Something going on. What's going on? Oh! What? I do not know what that was. <laughs> that was a steel hand. Yes. What on earth was that? All right. The, the army man got to go. You go first. You go first. Recap. That army man got to go. He's full of it. He going on like if he owns Superman. And I'm quite yeah. sure he know he have access to the kryptonite so Superman can react. That's why he's speaking to him like that. Right? He is full of it. Superman don't belong to America. And I don't understand why people have to believe that just because somebody helping you out. He belongs to the world. He's there to save people around the world. Here's the How thing. America Super gonna come first? Because the thing is, even though he wasn't born in America, he was adopted by Americans. He was raised in America as an American. My point is still my point still stands. He was born. He was raised in America from an infant. Okay, by American parents in an American state. It's, it's very American country is American country as 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 American country can get raised on a farm by American farmers. The guy is as American as it gets. But this, the only difference is, is that he made a vow to, to protect the world, not just America. That was his choice in the eyes of, of the Americans. In the eyes of the government, they see him as an American citizen. They see him, and he technically is an American citizen. He's like, oh, you're an American citizen. It's like, they, they, he's basically viewing it as a guy that was born in America, raised in America, and he's a soldier, but he's fighting for, he's fighting for Russia instead of America. That's how he's viewing it. Or he's fighting for so other why, countries. So why don't they treat everybody else who came from another place and live in here and they didn't belong here, but they may not have superpowers, but they want to, they don't want to take you as they own. They want to send you back home, but because this one got superpowers, they won't keep him. So loyalty only goes when it works for you. It doesn't work for anybody else. It only works for you. Once it don't work for you, well, to hell, I don't want you anymore. Yeah, I mean, yeah. Like, that's just really what it is. I mean, I feel like any country would do that. You know what I'm saying? Like, well, he need to slap cross his face because I can't take him number one. I need to full of it. Some no, of them or some of them or quick should suck he in. I agree. It's just that because I because like I understand like like you know how this world works, right? You know how this how this this world operates. You know how people in this world operate, right? Especially when it comes to like military military personnel and like people who like deal with their own stuff. It's all about like their own interest. No matter what country you're in, right? In, in this case, it just happens to be America, right? Like, I'm pretty sure if Superman was born, was like raised in England, right, and had British parents, I'm pretty sure um, Interpol and every pre and, and pretty much that entire organization over there, I'm pretty sure they would and 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 you know the prime minister would be down his back like you know that we only care about british interests we you, you should only care about what we say you should only fight for england you should fight for britain don't fight for for everybody else you know what i'm saying so i'm pretty sure the, the same thing made, would apply the anywhere man else made, the man made a declaration to save the world not just one place no i know i agree with you i'm just saying that like the result would have been the same no matter what country he was raised in he could have been raised in any other country and that country would have been like no you're you're our property you're you you should should um, you know england comes first america comes first brazil comes first i'm pretty sure any country that had super that know that superman well, was living there would be like that well all i can say in the words of the man in a comedy i saw he has an attitudinal problem he needs to check his attitude no and then number two you can take the man Chris that ain't come from yeah, your that, that. place to go and put it on these people, these fake people. Yeah, they don't even have dude. super hearing, they don't do nothing. And you can go and take the no, man they have, they have powers. Put... We don't know yeah, what powers but they, don't, they have. But they don't have super hearing. You can't create super hearing in somebody. We don't know if they have super hearing, man. We don't All know right. what power. I'm just saying we don't know what powers they have. That's just the truth. We don't know what powers they have. We've seen strength. For one, they have strength. They seem to have flight or speed. Um, but we just don't know exactly. I mean, nothing beats the original. Put it that way. 
he can create whatever he want to create unless they were born and raised in, on krypton even if they were born and raised on krypton nothing beats the original nothing will yeah, beat superman and, and he's saying but they did a good job but if superman wasn't there that man in that truck would have dead yeah right. i mean i mean even superman can't save everyone all i'm saying right now superman got work on this thing with he um with his hearing this girl got to come clean his about head, whatever, his head. yeah his head this girl got to come clean with whatever it is that she experienced at camp or maybe she has matured enough to realize that okay jordan is not for her maybe she didn't necessarily get a boyfriend but maybe she just mature and move on by going to camp or maybe she do have a boyfriend and she got a or, girl, tell... or, girl, or girlfriend. You never know. Whichever could one of the, it could be one of the two of them. Whoever Who friend in whoever friend is she friend in, she need to tell him. <laughs> you need to tell him. I mean, I I, I don't I, whatever it is. It could just be simple. It could just be simply the fact that like maybe she's just like I don't know, like still kind of scarred from what happened earlier that year and everything that went down with what happened in Smallville and just all the craziness and getting revelation that he yeah, has but when powers. The father, but when the father asked her how was Scam, she said it was real good and she smiled. Of course. Yeah, That's I'm the just... only difference. At that point, she didn't look like she was distressing. She smiled. Yeah, no, I. that's true. It's true. So... I'm with you. I, um... Yeah, I just don't know. I mean, I think we just have to see. We have to see ex what exactly it is. If whether she has a new significant other, or like you said, maybe she just moved on, or maybe she's I don't know. Maybe she's just still traumatized from what happened last summer. It literally could just be that too. Well, I'm not sure about the traumatization, but she smiled. She friend some friend. No, but I'm saying or okay. Maybe or she matured and she moved she's moving along maybe she's got a new perspective on life who knows i'm saying it can definitely be both both and or and or all of those things i mean i i'm just what i'm saying with the whole scarred is that like he you know she said everything she could have just been lying to her dad but he's in everything just kind of weird since you know everything that went down and then she was like yeah it's a little weird so you know, it could just be, it could be that, it could just be something else. Maybe she met someone else, maybe she's just not interested, maybe she moved on, maybe she just got more mature. It could be any or all of those. We just have to, we just have to see which one it really ends up being. That's just what, we'll just have to wait, wait to see exactly what that is. Well, the person who irritated me most in this whole show is a stupid man in the army. The lieutenant or whoever he be. I mean, you gotta. I yeah. hate people like that with that attitude. I hate. It. I don't like them. I'm, I'm with you. I mean, I'm with you. Very I, would... cocky and and demanding and very. And he knows very well they have access to the kryptonite. That's why he mm -hmm. talking to Superman like the old goat. Yeah, no. If they didn't have, if they didn't have something against him, they would have been like, they would have more likely listened to him and be like, okay, you know what? Maybe we should just do what he wants. But like you said, because they do have that, because he does have access to that, you know, it becomes a whole thing. But at the end of the day, he's still the OG. They can't out outplay yeah. him. Nah, they can't. No matter I mean, what if, they do. If the Eradicator himself, Morgan Edge, couldn't beat him, you know what I'm saying? Even though he did have, he did, he did have help. You know. Oh. Well, I am waiting to see what's going to happen because this thing getting hot. A lot of stories, of course. Yeah. First episode and so much stories. You got Jordan. We got the other brother. You got the mother, Natalie, um, the campaign. All these men dealt with women in their own way today. So let's see where this goes. I can't wait. And anybody who I want to get eradicated quick is the same man. Suppose there's a man come back. In in the, in in a military form, do the the um eradicator? No, I don't think so. I think that story is done with. All right, and who is the metal man coming through the tunnel? Who? The hand that showed the end. Oh, oh the yeah, no, 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 no. They, I, I have no idea. They're definitely gonna make that into another. They're definitely gonna make that into another thing. I'm trying to see if um. If I know this, uh, hold on, hold on. Let me see. Let's see if I know this dude. Um, I don't know. Maybe it's it's a Superman that has the cosmic armor. I have no idea. I literally well, don't I'm know. Well, I'm waiting to see what that is, and um, I don't yeah, think it's Brainiac. We... Dude, Brainiac wouldn't be down there. <laughs> so, 
I don't know. It had like he had like a little like light thing on his arm, so I don't know. He had like a shining light thing coming out of his arm. I have no idea. All right, and I'm waiting to see what it is. And yeah, so yeah, it was a good show. I'm waiting. Of course, it leaves me with a lot of thoughts and a lot of expectations. So I'm waiting for the next one. Yeah, I'm trying to think too about um. I'm trying to think too about uh. About, because I really like that opening sequence with the um, with the with the music too when he was taking that submarine out. Oh, that was great. Yeah, that, that was, was good. I'm gonna have to rewatch that. <laughs> that was real good. That was real good. I really that enjoyed that. That was awesome. Yeah, no, it was really good. So, but anyways, um, yeah, I think unless you have anything more to say, I feel like that's it, right? Yeah, uh, my highlight was the submarine thing. My other thing is that I need he got to work on this this head injury stuff, and the girl got to come clean. And of course, the man got to go. From soon as it start, he got to go for me. Can't take he. Yeah, we didn't get a chance to really talk about um about Natalie, but it's all good. And we'll we'll wrap it up here for now. And then we'll definitely continue to see what happens in the next episode. But I'm glad Superman and Lois is back. I'm glad that we're getting the show back again. It's it's one of my it's one of my favorite things to watch on the CW as of right now. Probably my only thing that's air, that's airing right now that I'm interested in. So looking forward to the next one. We'll see what happens with all this new congressman guy and Lana. There's so many different storylines that they're setting up for this season that can be really interesting. They're having a lot of foundational stuff. There's more development with Clark as a dad, more development with the kids. Hopefully they do something with Jonathan in the future. Hopefully they actually give him powers or make him give give, give him something to do. You know what I'm saying? I I, I feel like they, they need to utilize Jonathan some more. Make him steal. They need to steal move the congress. Well, they need to move the congressman and put um Lana to Timmy because she got more sense than he right yeah, now. Yeah, she I feel like that's what maybe might 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 be where they're going. She might be the congresswoman or whatever or whoever the mayor yeah, he, he he just at at loss so he couldn't pick that crowd up yeah he was he was he was booty he was trash um but anyways because if i was that coach when he asked the question he dodged it i wouldn't have been like okay i believe you like no i would have been like i would have been even more sus i would have been like um okay why why you to keep mad lana answer that question why lana have to answer right. for you so, but yeah. anyways, guys, we're gonna wrap this up because um, uh, we'll, yeah, this video we're actually doing this a lot later than we planned to do. Uh, so we have to wrap it up. So thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll see you all in the next one. Thanks so much for watching, Clockmaster and Mommy Master.